Ah, uh, let's see here. Does this thing work? What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to the fucking Elucid Show, where today we're going to be teaching you how to eat incredibly fast, do drugs, and get the power to remove the Roar XT virus, and also get these strength gains. Gains like at the gym? How dare you ever imply that I've been to a gym in my life? The gym is for self-improvement. Look at me. What's there to improve? Honestly, I thought you were talking about Vegan Gains, the YouTuber. I mean, at least we won't have a fan base as mentally deficient as his. Maybe we can have a fan base called, like, The Misfits or something of the sort. Hold up. Whoa, 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 whoa. I know what you're thinking. And we're not trying to get fucking sued here. That's not a word. Uh, anyways, back to the story. We got nothing! What? What do you mean we have nothing on the paper? You're my script writers. This is your one job. Why the hell am I paying you? Your ass isn't paying me. What? So a few days ago, I was just getting ready to riot and protect my Minecraft hut. Because, you know, while the rest of the world is dealing with corona, aka the pandemic, the US is on a fucking side quest. So, you know, I just woke up, strapped on my bulletproof vest, I bought on the app Wish, and just gathered my shit together until I noticed one thing. My phone was going off in the other room, so I basically just assumed it was Katarina, but it was actually Katarina's 51st boyfriend, none other than the homie Leafy is here. I was kind of confused because I didn't really expect to be in a Leafy video in 2020. Not once, but twice apparently. So that's pretty fucking cool. Anyways, thanks everyone for the recent growth. I really didn't expect to get here, but I am super thankful for it, especially in times like these where we have, you know, fucking super soldiers and angry dishwashers. But aside from all that insane shit going on, today we're going to be looking at a video titled How to Use the Necronomicon at Home. I want to talk about Necro motherfucking Namicon. Or, I'm just be real with you, the fucking Namakon. <laughs> Not this one, but when I found the video, it actually made me laugh a little bit. Oh my god, it's Necronomicon! Ah, uh, Mr. Black Darkness in his early years. Where did all this grass and rocks come from? What is this, 2011? I don't know whether I should tell him to avoid sharp objects or not. He looks like he bitches about not having enough eyeliner. But at least his gender camouflage is working pretty well. I can't tell if it's a girl or a guy. Hey dude, why is there a lock on that drawer? I don't know man, it says keep out. I try to just stay out of it and not really think too much about it. I don't think he really thinks at all to be honest. I mean look at this man, he's friends with this guy. And I'm pretty sure if he's friends with this guy, he needs fucking help. Well, you know what they say, rules are meant to be broken. I can sense the daddy issues for this video. I bet you that the only thing that is broken was his relationship due to how fucking cringy this is. Just let me check. That was really easy. I don't... Oh my god! It's Necronomicon! This is the type of dude to read Harry Potter and think that the spells are real. Oh wait, whoa, whoa. Hold up, what am I saying? They are real. And if you do believe they were, go to the comments and type Wingardium Leviosa to levitate the fuck out of this bitch. And if you don't, you're gonna be cursed with fucking 75 years of bad luck. And it's a good thing I'm safe because I'm friends with a bunch of fucking leprechauns. What the fuck, man? We had one rule and we broke it. We had one thing to do, and of course, we fucked up. That book do look rather spooky, though. So what if it's spooky? Unless you're part of the Mystery Incorporated, don't touch the fucking book because you're gonna end up dying first. I'm telling you, man, this is gonna end up like fucking Death Note and the guy's gonna write his name in the book and the dude's gonna fucking die. I'm just saying, if he looks like he has several guns in his backpack, I'm pretty sure he's gonna write his name in the book and he's gonna kill the dude. Where did all this grass and rocks come from? That really looks like the grass from out front. I'm pretty sure that's the grass out front. Yep, that's the grass from out front. I'm gonna go check out front. Why does he need to go check if it's the grass outside? I'm pretty sure nobody cares if it's the grass outside. And it doesn't matter because nobody gives a shit about the grass. I mean, it's like, it's like the meaning watch the grass grow. Who genuinely gives enough of a fuck to watch grass grow? I don't know, man. This kind of looks like the grass from out front. I think it is. Yeah, that's the grass from out front. 100% confirmed. Yeah, that's the grass from out front. So you're telling me this dude genuinely went outside for two minutes to compare grass types and see if it was the exact same variation. I thought he was smarter than the social repos about the makeup wannabe, but he already barely has a chance of 5 out of 10 intellect and he needs to start lower on the fucking totem pole. The instructions say to light this candle and call Smoochie Smoochie three times. Three times? First off, what the fuck, that is the stupidest thing I've ever heard, and second, I want to ask why, but I don't want the weird answer, so no thanks. Hold my hand and chant Smoochie's name three we'll times. We'll get everything we ever wanted. One second they're comparing grass, the next second they're calling out to demons to ask for a new razor blade or my chemical romance to come back. Damn how the world works. Who has 
summon Smoochy Smoochy. Freddy. Bernie. So when a demon just shows up after you summon it, you're just gonna act like this? Oh no, I'd be out of there. You have one wish. Choose wisely. I wish I didn't have to witness this type of shit ever again. Oh neat, we could like end world hunger or uh, become super famous and make lots of money. Or we could like, you know, uh, just adopt all the puppies in the world. This face does not look like it would treat puppies well. I mean, holy shit, I would never trust my dog near him. Even if my dog was wearing some sort of fucking armor or a shit ton of riot gear. I, uh, I have this really good idea. I guess where's the wish? So you mean to tell me out of all the things this guy can actually, you know, wish for, he wishes for fucking bread? Bread. Out of everything. I mean, I get there's kids starving for fucking bread, but like... He wishes for fucking bread? Whoa, 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 I didn't even speak it and I appeared! Oh, is this what I was telling you about, man? It's my idea. Oh, is this what I was telling you about, man? It's my idea. Why is he doing that to the guy holding the bread? This is just, it keeps getting weirder and weirder the more I watch it, and I wish I wasn't watching it anymore. Fucking strangest shit I've seen all day. There's 6.30, a bag. Can you believe it? We can save so much money with this. Like, end world hunger? Oh, bro. And hunger for ourselves. This has to be without a doubt the stupidest wish I've ever seen in my entire life. And honestly, I'm starting to think the emo kid is a lot smarter than this guy. Which, no, I'm not joking. It's actually, uh, <clears throat> pretty depressing. Oh, money. Like, we probably save at least, like, 66%. You feel? I mean, I guess we're saving a lot on nan bread. It's not so bad. <laughs> Weirdest skip thing I've ever seen, it literally ends with them wishing for fucking bread. I just don't see what's funny about this when it's just bread. Anyways, aside from the video, a lot of stuff's been happening lately and I will probably discuss this in my next video because there's just so much to get into where I don't really have a choice on what's going on recently and it was all insane. But that being said, if you haven't joined the Discord server, I'll leave a brand new link in the description. Hope you all have a good day. I'm Elucid and peace peace.